What's up, YouTube? This is Dave Brooks with TheVocalTeacher.com and soon to be out, mid to late February, The Virtual Vocal Teacher, a catalog of comprehensive, systematic video vocal tutorials designed to help all of you guys and gals uh, know when you're doing these exercises wrong. There are a lot of various and subtle ways you could be doing your daily exercises wrong. You don't even know it. This series is going to help you identify with those subtleties, those, those uh, misinterpretations, so you can immediately correct and progress. It's an awesome series. You're going to absolutely love it, and you're going to love the, the amount of content you get for the price. That's going to blow your feeble mind. So I'm so excited to bring this to you. Mid to late February, you all will get a countdown uh, pretty soon here uh, and let you know exactly when the, the exact day it's coming, but mid to late February. What I want to do now, though, is correct the video that I put out yesterday. It was supposed to be part two, how to translate your first vocal bridge. But me being an idiot and, uh, you know, I've just been so busy working on the final preparations for the launch of my new site that I duplicated the first video. <laughs> Don't ask. So I'm going to correct it right now. Um, guys, remember... Did the extension? No, 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 no. That's what we did first video, ladies. Extension. No, 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 no. Emphasis was on keeping every note honest by pouting through each note. You have seven opportunities to do the right thing, promote good form. Also, dropping the larynx at the top. That's what we discussed. And watching your volume spikes at the top. We don't want any uh, last-minute burst of air. Now, today, we're going to add to an extension to that extension. Um, I got a really good question from uh, someone um, from the first video, Fahimuchi. This is for you, brother. Uh, he asked me, Dave, do I need to use the same amount of volume that you used in your uh, explanation, an example of working the brakes? Do I need to use that same amount of volume when I practice? Because I'm noticing, and I'm talking about, he's talking about himself, I'm noticing that I, if I use that much volume, I start to tense up right past my E. And my answer to Fahamuchi was absolutely not. You don't have to use these volume settings. But the reason I'm doing this particular video is to typify, and I do, I do, I do it this way with everybody coming in, I want to typify, guys and gals, what you're going to be experiencing volume-wise when you sing your channels and your choruses in your songs, right? Your bridges are line up with channels and choruses. It's the start of those good money notes. So I always start my new clients off with volume settings that mimic um, what you're going to ex experience when you're actually performing a, a, any given song on any given day. That's just one way that I approach the breaks. There are many other ways that I approach the breaks, but this particular set of videos is designed and designated to those volume settings. Um, so let's just keep moving forward. Over the next several weeks, or not several weeks, but maybe the next two or three weeks, we'll attack the breaks in other areas and uh, um, realize more delicate uh, coordinations and come at the, at the bridges and breaks that way. Also, we're going to work it through resonance as well, in, employing some uh, pharyngeal exercises uh, and even lighter coordinations to um, uh, give you a more uh, precise uh, uh, method or way to translate those, those first vocal bridges. So right now, though, let's add an extension to the extension. And it's going to sound like this. Fellas, um, E, last week we did na 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 Drop down larynx at the top. This week, we're gonna, it's going to sound like this. We're going to extend that out. Na 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 for you ladies na 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 remember what am I doing I'm doing the same thing that I did in the first video Every note is a pout. It'll keep us honest, right? Every note. Also, I'm dropping my larynx at the top 
But instead of coming right back down after the four, I'm extending it out. I'm gonna really challenge those coordinations and we get to employ the use of vibrato, which is very important because vibrato frees up the mix. At first, um, when you try doing this, you may experience some um, inconsistencies in your vibrato. Um, the waveforms may, uh, you know, go in and out, and you, it'll be it'll warble a little bit. That just means that you're still working on conditioning the muscles to hold those levels of coordinations in place, and your vibrato, uh, e even though it's meant to free up the mix, at that point so early on, it's going to cause the coordinations to try to burst apart. So be patient with yourself. Work those um, breaks on the, the first set of uh, uh, conditioning. Na, 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 Do that several times in a row, up and down, up and down, to where you start to feel good. Then you can start doing these extensions. Uh, na, 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 Let that vibrato start to flow. Some of you may be experiencing uh, out there that, oh, I'm sorry, let me re recharacterize that. Some may experience uh, a very, very small amount of vibrato. Some of you may have problems with vibrato, period. And if that's the case, feel free to message me. I'll be happy to, to give you, uh, everybody on here, a free 25-minute consultation. I do it every day. No strings attached, no hard sell. 25 minutes free. If you don't ever come back to see me again, that's fine. As long as I can help you, that's what I want to do. Ladies. Na, 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 Right? Same thing goes for you. If you're experiencing a tightness up there as you try to spin, have the, the vibrato start to, to happen, don't worry about that. It will relax. You, It's just a matter of time. Muscles just take time. So, Practice these extensions three after you after you've done the five minutes of this. Um, na 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 na. Right, we've done five minutes of that. Then go to three to five minutes of these extensions. Trust me, you're going to get tired. Those three notes added on and then holding it out makes a huge difference. You will start to fatigue out, and you note you'll notice your ceiling from the first. Uh, a set of extensions is going to be lower than uh, when you hit the next set of extensions. Your ceiling will be a little lower. In other words, the top note is going to be a little lower than you hit the first time around um, for doing just the four and coming back down. So be patient with yourself. Drop that larynx and I'll try to allow that vibrato to spin because that will eventually free that mix up and uh, uh, you know really, really help you out there, okay? All right, so uh, first exercise, the extension number one. Na 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 na. For ladies, you get up there, right? Then go to the next set where you're holding it out and allowing that vibrato to spin. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, I this is just one way we approach the breaks, but I like to do it this way out of the gate because I want to mimic what you're going to be experiencing when you're actually singing your music, your, your songs, right? Then we move to other, um, uh, or to smaller coordinations, and we move to more pharyngeal uh, approaches, um, and uh, even uh, head voice. We appeal to head voice through the breaks. It's very important. Remember, head voice is the release of the mix, so we absolutely want to work through that. But I will cover all of this in, in coming videos. So for now, let's just work these, these good, Honest, what I like to call them, honest volume settings. All right? Okay, so I, I'm sorry about video number two. I've corrected it now. Extension number one, five minutes is no, 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 no. Extension number two, three to five minutes. No, 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 Right? Starting on that E. Right? Low E to top E. Working through that E, F, F sharp, and G for you high tenors. Females is the same thing. A, B flat, B, and even C for you legitimate sopranos, soprano ones, uh, and work that, okay? Any questions, comments, or other, please feel free 
to comment below this video. All I'm asking you to do is be nice. Some of y'all out there just, uh, man, I, I get some extremely uh, militant responses, and that's completely unnecessary. If you do that, I'm going to erase you and I'm going to block you. Be nice. There's nothing wrong with it. having a little discord. That's fine. But uh, I'm open to uh, comments and suggestions. And uh, the more I coach, the more I learn. And uh, that's what we're all here for. So it takes teamwork to make the dream work. So make sure you guys are commenting questions, comments, or whatever you want to do. Just be respectful. And let's have a nice, open, honest, intelligent dialogue discussion about working these breaks. All right. Until next time. Music is a universal language, people. Speak it with power, speak it with grace, speak it with confidence. I'll see you next week.